here with Brad Evans. Uh, Coach, first of all, congratulations. Another victory on Senior Day. Another shutout. Um, we'll get to uh, Vicki Traven here in a second, but you know, just to the team's composure here today and the most uh, unpleasant conditions, but they fought through it, got a good victory, and uh, you guys keep marching on. Yeah, um, you know, it was a, a little bit of a slow start for us. I thought the, you know, the emotions of Senior Day, and you've got five seniors all starting. Um, you know, it took us a while to, to, I think, really get going, and I give Buffalo credit. I mean, if they came out strong, they've been on the road, and tough uh, Sunday trip for them, and I thought they came out with a lot of energy, and, you know, were, were dangerous a, a few times. Um, but the game settled in a little bit, and we started to um, get a little bit more of the ball and create, and, you know, uh, finished a chance or two, and that's that's all it took. Mm -hmm. You know, just the the surroundings of you know senior day you know as bad as the weather was here today great crowd you know that really the people come out here and respect the job that you do as a coach your staff and these student athletes and that's got to you know you know put a smile on your face knowing that people will bear the elements of this kind of weather to see this team play yeah, for a soccer player this is good weather yeah <laughs> no i think we get good support obviously and um you know we try and you know, win games and hopefully that keeps people coming back and uh Again, credit to the team, and I think the, you know, the thing that uh, you don't want to make too big of a deal, but it shouldn't get lost, is you know Vicky uh, having the opportunity to set the record for most shutouts in MAC history, and you know obviously her backs and, and the mids doing their job, and the pressure up front all helps uh, helps in that. Players past and players mm -hmm. current have uh, all played into that, so congratulations to her. Yeah, I mean that's such a big thing, you know, a team effort on the defensive end. You know, she did not have to record a save today. You know, that just bodes well as you guys move forward because this back line is really starting to gel in the midfielder mm -hmm. with uh, the emergence of Alexis Tice in there. You know, talk about her performance, getting her first collegiate goal. She's really settling well in a position that was kind of a yeah. question mark heading into the season with Jamie Morcillo going down. Um, I think, you know, Alexis is the kind of player that you don't notice in a game. Um, but if you really watch it, follow it, study it, watch video... You know, she is a key component. She plays and has played pretty much 90 minutes uh, every game for us for quite some time now as a freshman in a, in a tough spot uh, and has done very well. Her ball winning is good. Her distribution has been solid. Um, you know, she's got, she's been durable, uh, which is important in there. And, um, you know, it's given our team uh, something of a, a lift at times. And that goal, I think it's she's earned that, you know, mm -hmm. through, through the course of the season. So... Uh, excited for her, and again, I think you know goals uh, put a team that's that's hard to score on, like Buffalo. Mm -hmm. That goal is huge. Um, I think it loosened us up a little bit too. Mm -hmm. And finally, um, the play of Nicole Jurjic. You know, um, in years past, it's been um, you know we had offensive players like a Molly Cornwell, um, a Ali Leak, sure. and then you had uh, Flynn, and so it was kind of like, okay, you could key on one or person, but now this year, it's like, okay, if you key on Kristen Lynn, then there's uh, Nicole Jurjic and Rachel McLeod, if you key on one, but now it's like you got to play straight up on them, and you guys have been able to expose that. Yeah, I think, um, you know, we've got a little bit of diversity in our attack, and I think Nicole will be the first to tell you she's leaving chances on the, on the field. In the last couple of games, there's been some obvious chances that she hasn't finished. You know, and I'll, I'll keep rolling players out. Is it, you know, if they're in position, that's important, and something's going to happen eventually. Mm -hmm. And you know, it's a, again, you know, Rachel, Kristen, her, and then you've got you can bring Ashley, Emily, mm -hmm. uh, Rio. You, you know, we've got some some options up there, and, and so I think the the whole group is doing well. Well, congratulations. You guys remain on top of the conference, and uh, you press on next week and uh, return to the road for the final time. All right. Well, thanks for coming out, Brian.